Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you how I prepare my favorite pepper steak. Here are a few of my ingredients that I'm going to be using. Some green sweet pepper and red sweet pepper along with four stalk of scallion four cloves of garlic and some ginger dice over here I have three head of pop cho well it's that time to start preparing that pepper steak we all love and enjoy I'm gonna make this a delicious one for you all my steak of choice is flat boneless steak let's add the ingredients half teaspoon of steak season half teaspoon of cayenne pepper with black pepper next half teaspoon of garlic scallion half teaspoon of old bay season half teaspoon of oregano half teaspoon of garlic powder half teaspoon tenderizer and salt with flavor enhancer instead of using some browning i'm going to be using some soy sauce on my steak add some dark soy sauce Next, I'm going to be adding some honey. Now, I'm adding a little of my diced garlic in my steak. I'm going to be using the rest later on to fry my steak and pop chow. <laughs> Add olive oil to pot, then we're going to begin frying our steak. Remember now, try not to dry your steak out too much because we need that steak to be nice and juicy. Here we have our steak all done, looking ready, tender and flavorful. Over here in my frying pan, we have the remainder of our ginger and garlic. I will be caramelizing the ginger in my olive oil. Then I will add my pop cho. Stir pop cho together with garlic and ginger. Next, we're going to be adding our cut medium onions to our pot now I'm gonna be adding a small amount of water to my pot just to make sure that my pop cho does not fry I need my pop cho to steam next I'll be adding a pinch of black pepper stir black pepper into pop cho then leave to steam for two minutes since I'm trying to get a crunchier taste of pop cho steaming time is less it's that time now to add our steak to the pop cho for a more tender tasting steak I'm gonna be steaming my steak for three minutes before adding the rest of my season and spices, especially my sweet peppers.
time to add my favorite sauce jerk barbecue sauce i'm telling you this is the real deal you will enjoy my pepper steak if you follow my simple ingredients looking really good delicious it is you can cook your vegetable to your desired likings but i prefer my vegetable nice and crunchy just like that my pepper steak is ready just like i promised simplicity that's what we got right here i hope you all enjoyed my pepper steak recipe don't forget to like share subscribe and leave your comments down below